You know, you can just feel the buzz in this city all day long, and we are seconds away now for this opening face-off. The Wild have established possession here early in this one as they win the draw. Moves it quickly over to Michael. Minnesota's got a hold of the puck now. Michael's got it in the offensive zone. Easily turned aside with the pad save. Quick pass to Barzell. Here's a shot. Oh, and he gets a piece of that one to keep it out. And now he moves it quickly to Johns. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Here's a chance. Stopped by the goaltender. This is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot, and makes the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. Here's a rip. Turns him away. Gains the zone from the right side. Minnesota's regained possession of the puck. Moves it to Kane. Oh, tremendous hit on the play. Look at that. He's on his own bench. Well, a great catch by his teammates, isn't it, James? As he lands on the laps of his own. And you know what? There's a lot of laps going on right there. They're saying, man, you got it. You got a good one. Minnesota's going to start with the puck inside the offensive zone. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Works it across to Romanov. Trying to gain a step. He's in all alone. Routine pad save made by Talbot. And we get a whistle as the goaltender decides to hang on to this one. Don't forget the team store, always accessible online 24-7. Uh, you can also check out the team store in the arena as well, open seven days a week. Minnesota's won the draw, they'll go to work. Made the stop on that play. Sorry for stepping on your toes, James, but that was a huge hit behind the play. And he turned that aside as we continue play here. Minnesota's got a hold of it against the wall. They've got some momentum here. Denied by the goaltender. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. Minnesota's won the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. And they got caught up in traffic and hits a stick. He's had a lot of offensive zone possession time, and you got to think that he knows he's one goal away from his next milestone. Here's a short pass to Emra. Oh, and it just stays out as he gets a piece of it with the glove. Sometimes goaltenders don't see the puck. It's a quiet shot, so their senses are taken away from them, so they just have to get to set positioning and hope for the best. Oh, what a stop! Looks to set up at the point now. And that's off target as it hits a body. A chance in front, and he denies that great opportunity there. Minnesota's looking to break out. He's in front! Oh, he comes up with a stop! The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. Nelson's got it along the wing. Oh, he hit him and caught all of it. Oh, and that's a tough one, James. They're along the boards. They don't have a lot of give. What that means, you're feeling it all. Jocelyn for the puck, and it's knocked away. It's a contact sport, people. There's proof right there. There's an injection of energy with that hit. Takes the puck at the point. Quick feed to Mayfield. Moves the puck over to Niskanen. Takes it across the blue line. Shot! Makes the glove stop! Michael's dangerous when he gets in one-on-one -on -one with the goalie, guys. His all-over zone ability means he's got the edge on the breakaway. Marcel's depended upon greatly by his teammates. He's one of the stars of this team and needs to produce night in and night out. I'll be watching these two players to see if one of them can really shine for their team today. Guys, back to you. Burns it in. Burns works the puck in his own zone. 
Moves it quickly over to Champion. Pushes it across to Michael. Centering key. What a chance, but they can't connect. Quick pass to Nosek. Oh, he'll feel that one. Minnesota's got the puck in their own end. The Islanders scoop it up along the boards. Minnesota's got the puck now. Moves it to Johns. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Makes the save with the Trapper. By slashing the leather on this save, the shooter's in a grade-A scoring area, and man, he just whips out the glove and makes the save. More than half the frame has been played here. The game is still scoreless. Horvath's won it off the faceoff. Slides it on over to Lee. New York's going to play it from the corner. Oh, what a stop by Dubnik. Dodd's been struggling to put up some numbers, and it can be frustrating to head into a pointless streak and continue. When that happens, you start to get down on yourself. It can really affect your confidence. you got to focus on the little things and try and keep good habits. Oh, what a hit on the wall. And that's a clean one, James. A great angle, shoulder to shoulder, and just laid it on thick. He scores! Patrick Kane! Well, James, this is a great play all the way around. A perfect pass to a perfectly executed shot as he sets up and waits for it right in his wheelhouse. Just lets the one-timer rip. The Wild have taken a one-goal lead here in the latter half of the opening period, and nice job by them. Yeah, really nice job, and they generated a lot of offensive opportunities because they've owned the puck, James. They've been first to it to retrieve it, and they haven't been afraid to put it to net. A lot of shots going forward here, and they've been rewarded because of it. Minnesota's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. New York's got a hold of the puck. Here they come. Minnesota's got the puck. And he slides it quickly to Enroth. Minnesota's got the puck against the half wall. Oh, he couldn't put it past. What a stop by Talbot. I love that he swallowed this one up with his glove. It's a real threat coming from the slot area. No rebound to boot. Denies on the play. Puck is frozen and we'll get a face off. Getting into the later stages of this period. We got a 1-0 game to this point. Stalls won a big draw on their own end. Here's a short pass to pull up. Shuts it down with the paddle. What a stop. He reads this play perfectly, James. He gets tight to the shooter. There's no room to put it by him. Minnesota's put a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead late in the first. Gained possession and his great work inside the face-off circle pays off again. And they'll go the other way with it. Great play by Barzell. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Grabbed along the boards by Stahl. From the neutral zone, moving forward here along the boards. Oh, he had the answer on that one. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Taken by Pellick. Quick feed to Nelson. Thunderous collision on the play. And look at the bench set up. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. The Islanders have it now. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Quick pass to pull on. Here's a back in. Long jam in front. That's broken up. How did he stop that one? I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. He doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. concludes the first 20 minutes of play. Second period action. Stick around.
second period set to get underway. Second frame is underway as the puck is dropped. Well, Cheryl, we got 20 minutes under our belts in this one. How do you sum up the performance? Both goaltenders are the stars in this one, James. End-to-end -end action and multitude of chances on both sides. I mean, this has been an incredible game to watch. I'm surprised it's only 1-0. The Islanders move the puck in the defensive zone. Oh, he rocked him on the play! Oh, you know that he felt that one, James. The body is reverberating after it. What a great hit. Minnesota's been rewarded for putting pucks on net here early in the second. Can they take advantage after winning that draw? And that goes off a body. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Quick feed to champion. Nice zone entry on the left side. Uses the force on that hit. Great reach with the hook check. Now a quick pass to Paul Mary. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Moves it to Thompson. Boom! <laughs> wow, what a thunderous hit there. Wow, uh, that was incredible. Everyone is on their feet. Man, did he get nailed. And he shut the door on that last play. There's a firm collision. Tried to make a move and the puck hops away. Trying a nifty move when you have good hands. Sometimes it works, sometimes you get denied, and that's what happened there. Great defensive effort with the stick. Picked up along the wall by Kane. Great stretch passes and connects. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. And he slides it quickly to Engvall. Taken along the wall by Mayfield. Big hit. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Dropped him in the open ice. Minnesota's got it across the line. The Islanders have it from their own end. Along the right side into the offensive zone. The Wild have gained control of the puck along the wall. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Fires it! Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. I love the way he gets to the top of his crease. You can see him bobbing up and down, trying to fight and find the puck, and he does exactly that to make the save. Can't get it to go. And that's knocked away in the defensive end by Pichon. New York's crossed the line and on the attack. Gostas Bear's got the puck in his own zone. Hollandville's picking up steam. Sent into the offensive zone. Handles the pass. Minnesota's got possession of the puck. Here's a short pass to Gostas Bear. Jostled off the puck. Pulak stick handling in his own zone. Sends the pass over. New York's got the puck against the boards. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Wow, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. Let's have a look at that last save again. It was absolutely incredible. You're under pressure. You're under attack, really under siege, and you find a way to get to the puck. This is the stuff that champions are made of. Still lots of time left here in this frame. One nothing is where we sit at this point. Michaels won the draw deep in the defensive zone. Dubnik's last save was absolutely incredible, James. Not only was it pure desperation and athleticism, but I'm not sure how he can stretch that far. I think he's been doing gymnastics in his off time. Johns explores his options in the corner. Hammers the shot. Oh, great save right there on the play. Oh, you can see the frustration in his face, James. He was right there. A perfect pass to slide across for the one-timer. He just couldn't execute. It was a great save. Moves it in front. Picked off in front. Quick feed to Niskanen. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. Dishes it to Lee. With the puck inside the defensive zone. The Wild have gained possession off the wall. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Minnesota's been rewarded for their high activity in the offensive zone with lots of shots, and they lead it here in the second. 
And they'll start with possession. Kane's so effective in the Ozone. I mean, he knows how to put the puck to the net. He got the go-ahead goal earlier, and now he's looking for more. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. Minnesota's ahead, 1-0. They take possession as he locks him up off the faceoff. And a great read to turn that play aside. Talbot's been dialed in right from puck drop, James. I mean, he's made the key save that he's need to make, and it's all about for a tender managing the momentum swings of the game. And the timeliness of the saves have really given his team an opportunity. Talbot's positional play in puck tracking helps him make saves when there's traffic in front of him, guys. His X-ray zone ability means he battles for a sideline to make the stop. Takes the puck. Scores! On the rebound, he pots it! Oh, James, I just love the effort and the battle and compete to attempt to make that desperation save. Unfortunately, he's unable to get a handle on it. The Wild have been having themselves a game tonight, wouldn't you say, Cheryl? Yeah, it looks like they're having a lot of fun. Why? Because they're up by a few goals, but they'll yes. need to manage the emotion within the game. They'll want to get to the intermission with that lead and continue to build upon it in the third. Tries to get the puck over to Koivu. Picks off the pass. On the attack along the boards. Takes a shot. Denies him in close. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. Minnesota's coaches were preaching lots of shots on net, and they have done it and lead as a result here in the second. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Minnesota's in now. Breaks up the pass in the defensive zone. The coach won't be very happy with that play, James. Listen, that's a good way to get your butt glued to the bench, especially when you have a lead. The Islanders gain possession. Looks to pass it to Thompson. From off the wall and onto a stick. Sends the feed in front. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Quick shot. but they have to have a willingness to find it and fight for any second shot, and that's exactly what happens here. Out battling, out willing, and you make the save. Just here in the late stages of this frame, 2-0 is the score. Michaels won the draw here in the offensive zone. Battle ensues for that loose puck on the boards. Great reach with the puck kick by Pellick. Moves it quickly over to Barzell. To the low side, and that's blocked. Through center along the wing. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Minnesota's coaching staff must be impressed with what they're seeing from their players tonight. Lots of pucks on net, and they continue to lead late in the second. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Fires it on net. Walker save. Knocks the puck loose. Quick pass to Burns. Inside the defensive zone, moving the puck. They've got numbers here. Slides it diagonally to Lee. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Scoops up the puck here. And it's a quick pass to Paul Mary. Puts it on net. Oh, what a stop with the paddle. What a fantastic save from a high danger scoring area, James. And I mean, he's bailing his team out. They have to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. And that brings the period to an end. All right, third period just around the corner. We'll get a clean sheet of ice. I'm going to get more popcorn, and we're coming back with much more next. One of your team players has the hardest shot. Who 
do you think is the fastest skater? We'll answer all of those questions at our skills competition. For tickets to one of the most exciting competitions this season, check our website out or call us here at the team. Two down, one to go. Third period, they're ready to drop the puck. Well, the moment of truth for both teams here as we are underway in the third. Well, with two periods played, Pounder, your thoughts? The Islanders can't get frustrated by a hot goaltender, James. They've been all over the offensive zone. They've thrown a ton of pucks to net. I think they just got to get some net front presence here, some flash screens, try and take away the eyes of the goaltender and put one by. Minnesota's benefited from lots of shots on net here tonight, and they lead it early in this third period. Michaels won it in their own end. And now he moves it quickly to Johns. Hugs the boards through the neutral zone. Nelson's taking it from his own end. The Islanders move it ahead. Moves it up through the middle from the right. The Wild have it in their own zone. Johns moves the puck. And they keep the pressure on. The Wild have taken possession along the wall. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Into the offensive end, right up the middle. Up along the wing. And he's got a step. Oh, what a save on the play. Whoa! Oh, that's grand larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. And these fans are still buzzing about what we just saw. What a save. That was sure. Yeah, he made an incredible save and really engaged this fan base. They're on their feet. You know they're right into the game. And listen, when they are showing you that kind of appreciation, you also want to play for them. Great go check on the reach. That's gloved by Talbot. When that shot came quick and it was right out front, he had to be sharp. He had to be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. practicing his face off so when the puck hits the ice you know he's ready his quick draw zone ability is what helps him win those matchups and gain possession guys it's something to watch out for throughout tonight's game look at this down the right wing they're on the attack all oh, those boards rattled after that hit whoa and he's rattling as well james i mean we knew that hit was coming and then all of a sudden boom and he's down for the count here we go pucks in deep Burns plays it now. Gaining momentum along the boards. Scoops up the puck. Stopped by the goaltender. Talbot's got it and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he's been so dialed in all game, playing confident and controlled in the crease. Minnesota's been total non-stop action on the offensive end, and they continue to lead in the third. Sisik is quick on the draw. Dobson's moving the puck through his own zone. Dumps the puck in. The Wild have possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Scooped up along the wall by Granlin. And he loses possession of the puck after trying to make one too many moves. Great stop by Talbot. Well, this is just a hard-working play by the goaltender. I mean, he's bopping up and down. Oh, break away! Moves it to the middle! Opportunity there. Quick shot. Denies him again. And that slides right out to center ice. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Mayfield's got it in the defensive end. The Islanders played along the boards. Oh, he just got thunderstruck. Well, he did. I mean, closing so quickly. No time and space there. And just crushes him. What a hit. Stop that one. Now the shooter's gonna run out of real estate because he does a great job of getting out of top of the crease and taking away all the room. When you make yourself as big as possible, there's less holes in the net. With possession along the wall. Beautiful saucer pass. Quick shot, denies him in front. Hammers the shot, there's another stop. Man, is he ever quick on his feet, anticipating the play. Excellent reflexes, he's saving his team right now. And he slides it quickly to Panic. Minnesota's got it along the wall. Tees him up! 
Knocks the puck down with a stick. Loses his balance on the play. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Dumps it in. Picked up along the boards by Vanek. Great hits up play with the stick by Koivu. Takes it across the blue line. New York's looking to break out of their own end. It's these types of games where you kind of shake your head and say, is there ever going to be a goal? And you get endless opportunities around the net and you can't finish. Often the stick gets a little bit tighter as you want that one so bad you can almost taste it and it's not just going in. Grabbed along the boards by Pulak. Pelix got it against the boards. Handles a sweet feed with authority. Moves it to Kane. He carries the puck up along the wing. Oh, they telegraph the pass and he picks it off. All alone! And there's the save. The Wild have the puck in their own zone. Minnesota's on the attack. Here's a short pass to Michael. Right on the doorstep. The Islanders have it against the wall. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Puck dumped in. Dished on over to Michael. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Shot! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. The Hurricanes are up next on the schedule, and I hear tickets are still available. A few select seats, so get them now. It should be a good one coming up. Minnesota's looking to close things out here. They've been the dominant team all night. Hard to see them taking their foot off the gas now. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Poked away and forces the turnover at center. Minnesota's across the blue line. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. From sending it into the attacking area. Can't keep a hold of the puck after that play. Coming up on the final minute of regulation time. The Islanders have pulled the goaltender here. They've got the extra attacker out on the ice in hopes of a goal. And that's broken up in the defensive zone by Hoffman. Picked up along the wall by Dawson. Heavy hit into the wall. And look at this. We're going to get a stoppage here as the whistle's blown. A pane of glass is broken. Well, safety is the first priority, and it was a thunderous hit. And as a result, there's a crack in the pane. And they'll have to replace that, James. The maintenance crew will come out here and make sure that it's taken care of. Here in the late go into the frame. And it's a comfortable 2-0 lead we're looking at right now. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Slides it in front. And scores off a skate and into the net. Oh, James, this is going to be waved off. They'll have to have another look at this to see if there was a distinct kicking motion. Call on the ice is no goal. Let's see what the video review concludes. Well, that goal just with a fire under the bench, James. Anytime you play with energy, it can be contagious. And it's shift by shift that you can drive your teammates forward. He's a leader, and he found a way to get his team on board. Fans get louder and louder with more time. That pass is under a video review. You know that the more it is looked at multiple angles. Sometimes the longer it takes, the more it's in your favor. And the official comes out and says it's a good goal. New York's going to start off with the puck here in the neutral zone after winning that face-off. What a steal in his own end. Oh, it stays out. He got a piece of that one. There's the whistle as the puck is frozen up. Minnesota's offense, the story tonight as they lead it here in this third period. New York's won the face off deep in their own end. The Islanders take it across the blue line. Oh, and a good textbook hit there. New York's trailing, that's why they've got the extra attacker out on the ice and the goalie on the bench. There's the whistle as the puck stopper likes to hang on. Well, he's looking to get back on his feet there. Man, did he take a tough hit. They've got the extra attacker out there, and Cheryl, you know what this means. Well, you have to get possession with that extra player on the ice. They'll look to win that draw and convert on their opportunity. They win the face-off here in their own end and take possession. To the empty net. Oh, but it misses the net. 
And that'll do it from ringside here. And the losing streak continues despite the fact that this was a game that was theirs for the taking. Yeah, and it's extremely frustrating, right? You felt like you could have had it. You came out on fire and you just weren't able to capitalize and get it done. So you're going to have to figure out a way to reset here, James. Easier said than done now. You can feel the energy just zapped out of this group. Thanks so much for taking time out of your schedule to join us tonight. From all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Sabalski. See ya.